you feel really special to be a part of it. And uh, I think it's it's like an overwhelming excitement, but in a good way. And no, it just makes you, you really proud of, of this program and grateful for the people who put it together. Well, it's right in front of you. And, and I think that's a big thing. And that was a big focus for, for our team suite was to make sure the history wasn't just a bunch of names that guys had heard of, um, but they could connect with them. Um, you know, and they could see faces and they could, they could really get a grasp of how long the history of this program is. Since 1938, the CC hockey program has only known triumph. From 10 conference championships, 20 NCAA tournament appearances, and two national championships, the boys in black are used to raising the gold. It's right there in front of you. You see it. There's no hiding from it. Uh, this this program has a, a great history and um, with some great names, and they've helped out with obviously this rink, but the program entirely. With more than 1,200 wins, the 14th most in college hockey history, Colorado College's name has been etched amongst the top programs of all time. While the top honor in college hockey. The Hobie Baker has twice resided in the hands of CC players. Still to this day, each year it kind of gets uh, hard to believe that I'm part of that group. There's been so many incredible players that have won that award. Um, you know, I look back at that year, I mean, my line mate Brett Sterling was a finalist. Um, you know, he led the country in goals by a long shot and um, I was surrounded by, you know, so many good players. I mean, you can't win that award by yourself. The Hobie Baker winner in 2005, Marty Sertich, learned from the best watching his teammate Peter Sena win the award just two years earlier. And then a big hit frees it up. That's delivered by you know who, Mark Stewart. Lead to Sena, pulls the trigger. Peter Sena has scored. He has broken the record. Well, looking back, we had we had good teams all four years. I mean, especially my freshman year, my junior year, but. Um, you know, so fun. I learned so much my freshman year, you know, playing uh, on a team, guys like Peter Sena and Tom Pricing and Noah Clark and Joe Cullen and I mean I could go on and on, but just guys that embodied what CC hockey is um, and I learned so much. They were such great mentors for me and, um, you know, I hope that I, I repaid the favor as I was an upperclassman to the, you know, to the young guys and, and kind of continued on the tradition. And this tradition of excellence has lived on. Over the last three seasons, CC alums have been on each Stanley Cup winning team while 2015 alum, Jacob Slavin, won the Lady Bing Trophy this past year. I mean, it just puts an added responsibility, uh, especially coming in, being here all four years. I see some of my old teammates up on the wall. I see some of my old coaches up on the wall. So, you know, you always got to think about them and how that they always live on and they'll always be a CC Tiger. So, you know, I'm just going to do everything I can and. Hopefully I can make everyone proud. But the tradition goes far beyond just the pucks and ice time, touching the lives of non-players. I hear you have a great story on how you met your husband. Can you tell it to us? Well, it was the first time I saw him after I had been introduced to him. And we were skating that old building at, out at the Broadmoor that, where the hockey games were. and. He, they were, were just goofing off, and he came up to talk to me and tripped, and his glasses went one way and he went the other way, and then he looked up and said hello, <laughs> which was typical of him. <laughs> so Colorado College and hockey in particular, they, they hold a pretty special place in your heart? Oh yeah, oh yeah. This bond between the Tigers and their community will only continue to grow, but now in a different location as the Tigers move from their longtime home at the World Arena to the newest on-campus arena in college hockey. My heart right now is racing every time I see this building. And then the spectacular new arena will build our wonderful men's, or bring our wonderful men's hockey team and fans home to play on campus for the first time in CC's history. A five-year project that started as a dream was realized thanks to the gift from former Tiger player and Olympian, Ed Robeson. Well, the first time I saw the building a moment ago, 
couple of moments ago, <clears throat> I said, gee, and you're not going to even know who this name is. The Chetty Thompson's name probably should be on that. <laughs> Those of you who have been here know who he is. He had a lot to do with hockey. He was the one that gave me a scholarship. For the first time in the 83-year history of Colorado College Hockey, the Tigers have an on-campus home with the opening of the Ed Robeson Arena. Oh my God, the whole place was full of memories. I, I don't know what, I mean, it's spectacular. From a top-notch fan experience. It's a closer environment, so it's going to be louder. And that always helps the home team. <laughs> to a state-of-the-art team facility that includes a physical therapy area with hot and cold tubs, a lounge area for proper rest and nutrition management, and a spectacular locker room, this building will be a driving force in the resurgence of Colorado college hockey supremacy. And I was hearing the students say, I can't believe that this is on our campus. And to see the students light up in that way, knowing that because many of our students weren't on campus last year. Somewhere, the student athletes were, but a lot, due to COVID, were learning in all parts of the world. They were taking their classes virtually, and so they were off campus, and so what did we do for a year? We built this. Oh, I'm, I'm sure that, that they, it will make it more enjoyable for the players. Uh, you know, I mean, when they're on the ice, it's hard for them to, to hear the crowd, but when, when everyone is so close, uh, to the players on the ice. Every seat in the house is, is that way, just about. Uh, I think it's going to be, there's going to be some interaction there uh, and some building off of each other uh, to, um, for the excitement in the games. Covered most of the corners. We just got a tour down in the locker room. What about that locker room? That is so many times different from any of the ones we've seen before. This is just, it, it's complete. It has everything.